Right, uh, here's a nice little uh, simple circuit so uh, that uses a uh, negative resistance. If I can uh, try and put it together with one hand, we're going to put a resistor in. There like that. So we've got a resistor in. Now uh, that's a 1K resistor. I've got a uh, 1000 microfarad capacitor. Plus side goes to the resistor. And bottom side goes down. Now we want the zero side of the uh, LED to go to the capacitor and somewhere up there. And then we've got now a uh, a 2N2222 where I've bent the, the base away. And what I'm doing is I'm going to put the collector across the uh, junction of the capacitor and the 1K resistor and the emitter down there on the positive side of the green LED. Now, if we were to get my 12-volt uh, battery here, uh, hook up red lead to the red and hook that up. Now if we grab the green lead now I don't know if you can see that there yeah? like I can but the refresh rate's not allowing us to uh, see it flash as quickly as it's flashing but it's a very interesting effect but, uh, basically what's happening is the uh, it's charging the uh, capacitor through the 1k resistor and then when it reaches uh, 12 volts the, uh, the properties of the uh, transistor break down and uh, it, it works as a negative resistor or uh, I think it's also called a tunnel diode and then uh, it allows all of the charge to go through the transistor and then light the LED up but uh, that's constantly flashing but uh, it's not showing on camera very well I think you're sometimes getting it as just at the point where it's flashing. But if I put it on the scope, uh, you may be able to see it better. So I'll do that now. Right, I've put my scope leads now. And I'll put them directly across the, uh, the emitter and the collector. And if we can have a look at that on the scope. So you can see that... Uh, What's happening is it's dumping all of the uh, electricity through the transistor and then it's charging back up again and then doing the same. If I can change the time base, you can see three of them there. And that's. Uh, let's have a look at this again. It's causing the transistor to work the opposite way around to which it should but I think the camera's not picking it up like it should because that's, uh, that's flushing about four or five a second anyway I found that quite an interesting circuit the uh, if anyone's got any uh, ideas on it or views, if you could uh, just drop us a line. And uh, thanks for watching.